looking to become the UFC middleweight champion of the world. Here he is, the number one middleweight contender. For a long time, this man has been one of the best 85ers in the world, but this title fight eluded him. It is here right now. He is healthy. He is smack dab in the middle of his prime, and he believes he is the best 85er in the world and is out to prove just that tonight and walk away with 12 pounds of UFC gold. So here he is, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world. This man ubiquitously regarded as the top 85er at present. Some people believe this is the greatest middleweight of all time. He certainly does, and he has goals even beyond that. He wants to be one of the greatest mixed martial arts athletes of all time. And in order to preserve that goal, this is a title defense, simply put, that he's got to have. All right, now our tale of the tape for this middleweight championship fight. So two years, the gap in age, and they both possess a similar height and reach. All right, to get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now! This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC middleweight championship of the world introducing first fighting out of the blue corner this man is a kickboxer making his professional debut here tonight he stands six feet one is tall weighing in at 185 pounds fighting out of coconut creek Florida, presenting the challenger priceless and now introducing the champion fighting out of the red corner this man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending UFC undisputed middleweight champion of the world, the King! All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it clean. Ready. Ready to fight. All right, here we go. Round one, outstanding matchup of strikers. Any chance this thing hits the canvas tonight, Chuck? I don't believe so. I think when you have two high-level strikers like you have in these two men, they're going to... Oh! Huge right hand! Lands a big right hand early. Oh! Nice straight punch. Potential fight enders here in the early going. Nice one two combination there. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh man, hate to be hit with one of those knees to the body. Oh! Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! He needs to start looking to 
finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. What a fight. Oh, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. So he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Oh, nice job here staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. And back to his feet. Big ball for punch lands. Now we'll get back to range. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut the wow. eyes off. Goodness, what a fight. A near perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So, just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. And there he is, our UFC middleweight champion of the world. What an outstanding knockout here to finish the job tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at 3 minutes, 45 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world, the King. So you just heard it there from Bruce Buffer and still UFC middleweight champion. He had some doubters coming in. I would imagine he muted most of that noise with this effort. A record on repeat is what happens when this guy fights. Yeah. Every time people say he's not going to be able to get this guy. But over and over, he does it and remains the champion. Congratulations, champ.